Hey guys, it's Arthur Serra, your eighth grade friendly senior citizen news anchor. Um, next to me are next year's two senior news anchors, not senior citizens, I've been told. Um, these guys are going to be taking over for me because I'm leaving this year. Uh, introduce yourselves, guys. This is My name is Ali. I think you should know that. And this is? Baker. Yeah, so these two will be your next news anchors. Uh, so do you guys have any things you guys want to say to the crowd, guys? Not really. Um, this should be fun. Yeah, exactly. So this is my last and the eighth grade's last um, episode for Case News. Hope you all enjoy it. Uh, yeah. Let's do it! Whoa! Yay! Ooh. Let's go. Okay, hey guys, it's Doodle Government Tea Time with the tea. So, it's gonna be a boba day. A boba tea day, oh my god. Um, it's gonna be on April 19th. And it's gonna it's gonna be boba. It's not free. <laughs> <laughs> it's not free, yeah. And then a month later there's gonna be a dance. It's on May 31st and it's gonna be a dance. It's gonna be the last dance of case. And so for you eighth grade, it's gonna be your, your last dance period. So you come. And then the more people come, the more money we'll have. And eighth grade, if we have more money. We'll have more money for Great America. And if you have enough money, we'll get you guys fast passes. That probably won't happen, but whatever. Okay, that's it. That was a great smooth government announcement. Now on to sports. This is the new JV sports announcement. So the next girls JV game will be on April 29th against Live Oak at 4 p.m. While the next boys JV game will be on uh, April 26th against Synergy at 5 p.m. That was a great sports announcement. Now on to reviewing the map. Hello everyone! I know you guys are all wondering who the winner of the LC mascot contest is. All 15 of your entries were very creative and awesome. But of course, there can only be one winner. In third place goes to Ray the Jackal by Chihiro. In second place, there is a tie between Oscar the Otter and Leo. Finally, My the Dragon by Ella A1. Thank you, everyone, for sharing with you. Hey, they won. No one to getting some advice from Stella. Hi, and welcome to Help! My Life is Falling Apart with life. Advice with <laughs> Devin and Stella. If you're having trouble uh, with studying for the right things, you should ask your classmates what you need to study for. I know, like, the seventh grade basically is like an entire group chat um, devoted, to... devoted. It will not just studying, but like, there's a lot of questions that go there. So, yeah, and if you're struggling with your grades, check with your teachers to see if you can redo assignments or do like some extra credit work. So, yeah. <laughs> I congratulate you for having so much time on your hands. Watch all that YouTube. I'm a very busy person and I haven't watched YouTube since like last year. As for throwing fits like a seven year old man, I don't really know how to respond to that. I'm sorry, but I'm very confused. Don't worry, you're just as good as ever as everyone else. You're perfect just the way you are, and I'm sure you'll worm your way into someone else's heart. <laughs> I feel bad. Well, uh, that's all we have time for today. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Great advice from Stella and Devin. Oh, look who stopped by. Hi, we're here with some Case alumni, Michaela and Martha. They graduated last year and they are currently ninth graders. What high schools do you guys go to? I go to Cho Rosemary Hall. It's a boarding school on the East Coast. I go to Drew. It's like a few blocks away. <laughs> My grade. The Chinese grade. class. 
Tongue washer. Okay. And the people. like the faculty too. Yeah. Because they're so easy to talk to. They're like your friends. Mm -hmm. You aren't in a bubble anymore. You got to meet new people. It's like nice being in high school. Yeah. Like there's nothing better. like in specific I am happy about Lita being like at Case. It was more just like the feeling of leaving Case is like kind of nice because you get to like expand your horizons and you're able to like be in a high school. And like you meet new people because you've been here for like 10, 9 years. <laughs> Do you have any advice for kids who are applying to high schools or going to high school within the next year? Don't, Don't stress about, about it. <laughs> Don't stress about it. You'll end up somewhere. Miss McLeod is really helpful. Miss McLeod is the greatest teacher and go to her if you want anything, need anything, want to talk. Wherever you end up, it'll be like a second home to you. Yeah. And you'll love it no matter what. So don't stress about the name of the school. Think and about like, where you want to go. Yeah, don't think about where your friends or your parents want you to go. Just don't be peer pressured. Be, well, your just incorporate, kind of incorporate like their ideas, but like it's really about you and where you think. Incorporate. I guess that's all we have time for today. Thank you so much for stopping by and for being in our case yeah. episode. For Thank you for having us. It's been a real pleasure. Yay! Welcome to Storytime with Emma! Today I will be sharing one of Aesop's fables. This one is called The Young Crab and His Mother. Why in the world do you walk sideways like that? said a mother crab to her son. You should always walk straight forward with your toes turned out. Show me how to walk then, mother dear, answered the little crab obediently. I want to learn. So the old crab tried and tried to walk straight forward, but she could only walk sideways, just like her son. And when she wanted to turn her toes out, she then tripped and fell on her nose. So the moral of the story, don't be like your mom. <laughs> Do not tell others how to act unless you can set a good example. Thanks for watching Storytime with Emma! That was a wonderful story. Thank you so much guys for watching the, the final episode of Case News. Yeah, we did so well, whatever whatever was in it. Uh, yeah. Terrific! <laughs> Everyone say bye to Arthur. Bye, Arthur! Bye! Bye, bye I'm, 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 I'm going to miss some of you, not all of you. Bye! I'm kidding, I'm going to miss all of you. Bye! Bye! No, bye. As my final act as Senior Citizen News Anchor, I will drop the mic because I can. Sarah out. Hi, my name is Andre Chung, and this is behind the scenes. So here's some people doing some work. Well, even though you're not supposed to eat in the LC, but at least that's okay, right? Case news people, priority. Nobody in here. Hi. Ship that. I did not more people doing that. And these are a bunch of editors. Wow, that's... <laughs> what did you say? Yeah, hi. Hi. Oh. Yeah. Same again. Baker, I think. Baker, yeah, hey, Baker. We don't, we don't need you. Just we... Okay, bye. Why are you here? That's all. And Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back with Dow Pro. So I hope you have a good time watching this episode. I'm Esther and I'm making it. And from you might know, if you're asking for the second class of the case news, it's a little bit earlier. But it's also my second class of the case news, so I'm not the